Looks like a big snow or big rain is coming to me. It could be pretty messy here. I'm out on this little walkway. No vehicles allowed. I'm just walking towards that little island there, which is a gull island. Oh, I feel like if I feel like it, I'll practice shooting these gulls as they fly by. There's no shortage of gulls and terns on the Summer Lake Wildlife Refuge. This is all mud flats here, as far as you can see. And it will be filled with birds from time to time. I don't know where they're at now. There's some out there, but not many. Dowagers and uh, avocets and black neck stilts and western sandpipers and God knows what, common snipe and everything out here. But man, look at that storm coming at me off the rim. It could be pretty bad. I'm headed back to my truck. This looks like one heck of a blow over here. And I don't want to get soaked. And I don't want my Sigma lens to get soaked either. Made it back to the truck without getting wet. It's really coming down. This is a lot of rain for the high desert. And it's socked in everywhere. And it's dark. So, um... It just comes off of the rim and pours in here. I just thought I'd show you a picture of my lens and camera, which I do have to keep dry because that's that's not a uh, waterproof lens. And then my strap, I just throw it over my back and I never have any trouble with the weight. It's easy to handle for flight shots. And I'm getting to where I can pretty much just nail something in the air, just to, you know, find it pretty quick with 600 millimeter and nail it in the air, but it takes a little bit of practice. But anyway, look at it coming in. It's really wet out there. There's a white pelican, American white pelican. Turn off my windshield wipers here. See if I can focus on it a little pretty good to get it with an iPhone. They were just flying away a little while ago. That's a little zoom on the 7 Plus, but now so much rain on the window you can't see it. It's been snowing and hailing and raining. Here comes some poor person all afraid. They're going to slide off into the mud, into the drink, I mean, on the mud. That pelican might be injured, I don't know. Most of them would fly by now. Anyway, I'll drive along here and see what we can see. But I do have a feeling there's something wrong with this one. It wouldn't normally, wouldn't normally be like that. On a sandhill crane out in the water, you can just see the little spot there where it is. And maybe I'll get a shot of it walking across the water. Let's see if I can get a little closer with the video camera. A little opening here. There we are. You see it uh, walking right there in the middle of between the bushes. Pretty good to get it with an iPhone. Oh, so I filled the buffer on my uh, camera then. That Samuel Crane just walks across this little clearing and I got the uh, shots you know with the AI Cerebo. Hopefully they're in focus of it moving uh, with its kind of a walk I should be videoing it with a video camera on the uh, 7D Mark II but anyway that was in early see him but there's a couple of um, black neck black neck stilts out in that uh, pond along with some mallards things aren't flying as readily because of this big storm that just blew over kind of slows them down a little bit that's interesting but I'm going to take pictures of them